Fiji, 300 islands in the middle of the Pacific Ocean, famous for its crystal clear waters, swaying palm trees and perfect beaches. Some call it paradise, and within that paradise there lies a real slice of heaven. 20 volcanic islands just off the northwest coast of Fiji's main island, Viti Levu, that epitomise the unique blend of rustic charm and dramatic beauty that is Fiji. The Yasawa Islands. Famous as a location for that Hollywood classic, The Blue Lagoon, which starred Brooke Shields before she had to do sitcoms, the Yasawa Islands were once isolated and difficult to reach. In those days, the Yasawas were only for the rich who could afford the couple of luxury resorts on the islands, or for those on a budget, visiting the Yasawas meant a full day in a leaky boat. Not anymore. We came to Fiji to explore the Yasawas. Our mission? Pack as much fun and relaxation in as possible on a reasonable budget and discover the real Fiji along the way. From Mandy, Fiji's major gateway, Awesome Adventures Fiji provides pickup from most accommodation venues to meet a daily departure of the Yasawa Flyer to the islands. The concept is a classic marriage of modern technology and local culture with the Yasawa Flyer, a super fast, super comfortable 25 metre catamaran operated by Awesome Adventures Fiji. Opening up the Yasawas to travellers and in doing so, connecting villages and small communities throughout the islands with the mainland in just a few hours. If you want to do your own thing, there are Mbula passes, giving you unlimited travel within the Yasawas for up to 7, 14 or 21 days. One of the Yasawa's other claims to fame is the diving. Awesome Adventures Fiji uses one of the best dive operators in Fiji, and it's fully worth taking an introductory lesson to check out the views from under the water. The isolation of the islands and the relatively low population mean the marine environment is still pristine and abundant. And with the clear, warm water and great visibility, you can see for miles. Our next adventure rated a must-do in the Yasawas. All on board the Wanataki Cruise. Here you can experience cruising the Yasawa Islands in style. Air conditioning, hot water showers, welcome cocktail and free awesome activities. In your own floating home away from home. Literally, it's as big as a house. The lower deck is pure heaven with its air-conditioned accommodation and lounge area, day or night. The top deck is your mouth-watering buffet restaurant, cocktail bar, sunbathing area, dance floor and dive platform all in one. Not forgetting the stunning panoramic view it provides. After making ourselves at home and devouring a huge lunch, it was time to work it off. The surrounding islands offer the chance to explore independently or join one of the guided island visits. Instead of hitching a ride back to the Wanataki cruise in the longboat, we decided to snorkel home through the crystal clear waters, checking out the locals on the way. Hard corals, soft corals, schools of tropical fish and brilliant blue starfish. After a hot shower, we made for the bar to try one of the many cocktails on offer. Sex on the beach? Make mine a double. Tonight we were treated to the traditional Wanataki feast. And of course, to wash it all down, Fiji's national drink, kava. For those of you not so keen, there's chilled wine and beer on board. To keep with a the Fijian theme, the crew provided a crash course in Fiji dance, Tara Lala, the snake dance and limbo. No rhythm required, just a sense of fun with a memorable night guaranteed. The best way to clear your head in the morning? Take the plunge and jump overboard. Fresh coffee and a cooked breakfast await you on the upper deck. Hola. 
After breakfast, the crew organised a visit to the local village, where we met the owner of the islands and their surrounding waters, the High Chief. They call him Ratu. Here, we were once again to discover the warmth and hospitality of the Fijian people. Giggling kids wave happily, calling out Bula from their doorways as we made our way around the village. It really is an eye-opener. <laughs> the local boys demonstrated why Fiji is at the top of the World Sevens rugby, while the women displayed their homemade arts and crafts. To top it off, we were treated to an unforgettable performance of local song and dance, which the locals seemed to enjoy as much as any of us. We had an early start the next day, and for good reason, snorkelling with manta rays. Just off the beach we bumped into a school of these guys and it was definitely a Jacques Cousteau moment. But Jaws fans don't panic, these rays might be huge, often up to several metres across, but they're totally safe. They actually seem to enjoy having us looking at them. Back on board, it was a tough choice between tossing a line over the side, soaking up the sun, or kayaking across the lagoon to yet another deserted beach. Bula! Bula! Before we knew it, it was time to leave with yet another chorus of Fiji's famous farewell song, Issa Lei. I'm definitely coming back here. The Wanataki crews can be joined from Nandi with the Yasawa Flyer providing daily links. Take the standalone cruise or combine with an Awesome Adventures Fiji package like the Ultimate Lay or join while island hopping the Yasawas using the Bulla Pass. Jumping back on the flyer, we finally headed for South Sea Island, just 25 minutes from Denarau, but a million miles from home. Basically the island is one big beach, with all the water activities you could ask for, plus a bar, pool and a place to crash. What more does a girl need? It's the ideal place to chill on the way back from the Asawas and ease the culture shock that the thought of heading home brings on. From South Sea Island, we also spent a day sailing the outer Mamanuthas in the Sea Spray, an 83-foot schooner. For the film heads, you also get to visit another Hollywood destination on the trip when the Sea Spray calls into Mondriki Island, the shoot location used in Castaway, where you can make like Tom Hanks, hopefully without that beard. Personally, I definitely wouldn't mind being cast away there myself. Too soon and our ultimate lay was over, and it sure was a great lay. Our mission for fun, relaxation and the real Fiji was 100% successful. Once the best kept secret in the South Pacific, the beauty, adventure, the Fijian people and unique way of life of the Yasawas has now been made accessible to travellers looking for that perfect tropical adventure. So, next time you need a holiday, there's just three words you need to remember. The Yasawa Islands. Oh yeah, and three more. Awesome Adventures Fiji.